For our opening Bizarre Adventure Time theory, we have a probable idea of Betty finding a cure for Ice King, which is justified for the fact that the producer showed her leaving cloaked, foreshadowing she's leaving in silence to look for something. She even promised him that she would help him and try to cure him. However, a mini-theory has been pulled along with this, and there's quite a buzz with this whole thing having to do with Prismo in the time room where Ice King won't be affected by the crown, or Betty could wish for Ice King's sanity and life back, because we all know if it were Ice King, he'd be like, Oh, Gunter, my first Fiona and Kate story was so mad, I must write another! And he'd wish for his Fiona and Cake fantasies to be for real. And let's be honest, no one will be too disappointed with that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, never mind, never mind. No one will be disappointed. On to our fourth bizarre theory. For this, we have the Lich coming back for the third time. I can see why this theory is popular because it'd be no surprise if the producers decide to have some twist where Prismo or Cosmic Owl interfere with the multiverse that Lich is stuck in and he escapes. Because I think it's been well established that the Lich is extremely powerful and is matched well versus Prismo or the Cosmic Owl. And here we are at three which by far is the most popular. I'm sure most of you have heard of this theory because there are so many signs of it in the show. The whole idea is the probability that Finn will end up losing his right arm. In every vision of himself, there's been some sort of replacement for his right arm. In the pillow world, it was a pillow arm when he was very old. In the episodes Jake the Dog and Finn the Human, it was what seemed to be a simple prosthetic mechanical arm and in a dream of himself, a high-tech robot arm, almost like a Swiss army knife. The reason this has gotten so popular is because due to the new Blade of Grass Sword and about him complaining about its grip and his dreams of having his arm consumed by such an object, just backs this theory up even more. Other evidence includes when he talks to Rattleballs, which says you will only be a true swordsman with 10 years of training and if he had a robot body or arm. Even past selves of him, such as Shoko, had a lost right arm, which continues to back this whole point up. Nevertheless, the reason why this is only third out of all of these bizarre terms is because it's very much more likely that this will end up happening and the producers will end up having his arm somehow viciously ripped off or maybe i don't know the blade just ends up taking it off but this is more probable than the ones to come for number two i have a really unlikely fan made theory mostly involving fiona and cake partially with number five some believe that fiona and cake will meet finn and jake as if possibly their worlds may meet or combine. In order for this to happen, there may be a calling where Fiona and Finn need each other's help to defeat the Lich who may escape in the multiverse he is trapped in. Okay, so for our final most absolutely bizarre theory, that is extremely unpopular with fans of Adventure Time is the possibility of Phil or even Ice King being Finn's father. I don't believe this is particularly true, for at this point it may be glom for all we know. But really, I believe this is totally false due to the outline of a man after Billy told Finn his real father was alive. To be honest, a whole new character will probably be admitted to the series. It's because you never know what they're going to do, and we've already discussed this whole thing with Jake's father, and, and things may probably be different for the next few episodes. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please subscribe and post challenging comments to these theories in the comments menu. I would also like to point out that if you're watching this now, and maybe this is at a later date, that this is only in recollection to 
Billy's bucket list. So please, don't try to challenge these theories if you're watching this at a later date. And there's been new evidence to kind of destroy some of these theories. Um, but again, thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed some of the top theories on Tumblr. And I will be posting the links in the captions.